Word on the street, she said, was painting is dead, but Elizabeth thought to herself, oh really? Well, the hell with that idea, I'm painting it, quote. And like your mother tells you you can't do something, I'm gonna do it. Tonight I'm going, or at least I'm planning to go, knock wood, I make it there. Um, Roberta Smith, the art critic for the New York Times, is giving a talk at Stanford, and I'm planning to be there. I thought it was going to be packed, but it's not. <laughs> That's cool. This bathroom is so cool. <laughs> images of paintings that we didn't have last time, things that he's found, some of which are, we don't know where they are, but so t look hard. You might, you might be living with one, you never know. <laughs> I was working for Paula Cooper at the time, and my memory is that I went by myself to see Elizabeth's work before Paula, and that has now been contradicted by Paula. <laughs> so, and Paula most recently, even this week, said, they went together in the morning, but Paula returned in the evening. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I have a memory of Paula being there, and I thought I was there at night, so... <laughs> This is where you can group edit. Oh my gosh, I love that. Ooh. That's how I printed my scrim that we just critiqued. Oh my god. It's on this. Hey. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> documenting We're and vlogging. freaking out. We're vlogging. Maybe <laughs> group editing. <laughs> you must be currently enrolled in an experimental media course to access the digital print studio. So unless you're a graduate student. And then you can do whatever the frick you want. <laughs> Shereen, on a scale of 1 to 10, how much would you recommend Stanford MFA? 10. 10. 
Great. I was like, what's this game? Shireen and I just double duty rode on her electric scooter. <laughs> it was scary. <laughs> and now we're in our studio. <laughs> And a lady yelled at us that we should have lights. And well, like, we did, have light. we did have a light, but also true. We were probably practically invisible. Yeah, <laughs> still. It's like, we have lights, like, we okay. <laughs> These are some well treated plants. All my plants get sparkling water. Wait, what brand is it? It's just the Whole Foods brands. Oh, and yeah. Now it's in the trash. Hi. Um. I just got homish. By homish, I mean I just ish got home, but I am home. But <laughs> I got home like 20 minutes ago and I um, made myself some quesadillas for dinner because it's like 10 30 and I didn't really eat dinner. Shireen, my friend who you just saw, very kindly gave me, <laughs> she like fished out of her backpack one Ferrero Rocher chocolate, a clementine orange and um uh an rx bar protein bar so i had that to hold me over but um yeah i just wanted to i guess give some context to what you just saw <laughs> um and also just kind of like wrap up this video because i'm guessing this will be the end um so today i went to work <laughs> And then after work, I went to this talk at Stanford with Roberta Smith, who, if you don't know, is the co-chief um, art critic at the New York Times. And um, it was in conversation with this curator whose name I'm forgetting. Um, they were talking about the artist Elizabeth Murray, who was a painter. Um, and she has a show at the Anderson Collection at Stanford right now. She passed away in 2007, I believe. Um, not sure. Anyway, I just basically jumped at the opportunity to go see this talk with Roberta Smith, because she is a really big deal in the art world. Um, and as you will have seen, I showed up like an hour early expecting a crowd, because at Berkeley I got turned away from events with some regularity. So I was like, okay, I need to be there early, like doors open at six. I was like in my Uber like, Ah, freaking out about the time. And then I got there and it was like myself and six old people sitting in the lobby. So I just got to <laughs> explore the theater for a little bit, which was great. Um, and then went in and sat down and then I like looked one row down and was like, oh my god, it's Shireen. Um, so I went and grabbed a seat with her and she's in the Stanford MFA program and I had met a couple of her cohort uh, at an open studio event, like maybe three or four weeks ago. So it was nice to see them and catch up. And um, yeah, it was just great to see her and we ended up hanging out. She had, It turned out that she had, as you will have just seen, she had a crit tonight, so um, for a show that I'm actually planning to go to the opening for tomorrow. Um, it's the first year MFA show, so I got to join in on her crit, which was awesome and just like super nice to be back in that environment. And then um, she took me on a little Stanford art facilities tour, which, oh my God, they're so nice. And then she had like a little electric scooter thing and we like both got on it and rode it back to her studio, which was really fun if um, a little bit scary. And then she kindly gave me a ride home. But um, yeah, it was just super awesome to be with like artists, friends. Um, it can get kind of like isolated here. So it was really, really nice to just like hang out in that environment. Um, also, like a cool little moment, I was talking with Shireen, and then the guy that was sitting next to her is a painter who's also in the MFA program, and he was like, oh, are you an artist? And I was like, yeah, I am. Um, and he asked what I did, and I pointed to my shirt, which, <laughs> you know, the old fave, and I was like, oh, I do, this is, like, me, this is my work, and I do, um, you know, like, photography and styling, kind of said my normal spiel, and he was like, 
oh, I've seen that image before. And I was like, what? And he was like, yeah, um, do you know Graham and Megan? And I was like, oh yeah, I just shot with them. That's where, like, I was with them when I took this photo. And he was like, oh yeah, like, I saw all those pictures on Instagram and I liked them. Um, so it was just like a really nice moment of feeling, you know, con still connected to the community. And it was awesome to hear, like, he had seen my work and it was very um, validating to hear that he like recognized my work. It was like really cool. All in all, a great Wednesday and thanks for watching. Bye.